everyone, and welcome back to The Walking Dead. Um, uh, are we being watched? Oh, Jesus! Ah, 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 ah. Hi! Hi! How's it going? Ah, ah, stop! Hey, it's me! I learned. Luke. Luke! Yes! Man, bit the hell out of me. I bit a dude's finger. Blood. Come all this way. Oh. This is this is the welcome I get. I'm sorry. I was worried. We all were. Now it's good to see you too, kid. All right, listen, we ain't got much time. Okay, I followed y'all here best I could. I haven't had a night's rest since y'all got nabbed. And, well, that's the first chance I got to talk to somebody. <laughs> They're everywhere. Okay, they got guards watching everything. Mm-hmm. Shh, shh. Oh, you look There's a herd sick. of lurkers just south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around these parts. Carver mentioned that. Said he hopes it passes us. Yeah, I heard folks talking about that, but that ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming, and it's gonna be soon. Jesus. See, I've been looking for places to, to get you all free. Okay. But I haven't been able to find anything yet. They plugged up okay? all the holes we used when we got out. Are you feeling okay? No. No, I mean, uh, yeah, yes, sorry. I, I just could use some sleep, you know? Hard to rest when you think a lurker's about to get the jump on you at any any moment. But yeah, <sighs> yeah, I'm fine, okay? Don't worry about me. You look it like you have insomnia. Well, the whole situation's dangerous, but, well, we're in it now. That's what we got. We just, we just need a plan. No way to get you and, and everyone. Uh... Luke? Oh, sorry, sorry, shit. Okay, Troy ain't gonna like you being late. Listen, Clem, I need you to meet me here tomorrow about this time. Because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just just one of those walkie-talkies. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with them guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Okay. Look, we ain't gonna be able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. Okay, okay. I'll get you one. Thanks, Clem. I'm so glad I can count on you. Remember, Aww. you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try yep. to be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can, because I really need one of those radios. And just let everybody know I'm all right, okay? I'm worried they, uh... Jeez. <laughs> Go on, get out of here. Okay. Have fun. Ugh. Hi. What the hell were you doing? Looking at comics. I was looking at comics. There's a whole store full of them. Yeah? No shit. You best not dawdle, girly. Pull something like that again and you'll be meeting the back of my hand. Bill uh, Radio wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there, now! Okay, jeez. Clem darts it. Oh, jeez. He's so rude. Freaking Troy. Yeah, Carver. Oh, yeah, that dude. That you just saw walking up the hall. He's from 400 days as well. His name's Dwight. Dude, you better go up and see Bill. He doesn't like to wait. Yeah. So, you should probably go. Uh-huh. Or at least I think his name's Dwight. If I remember correctly, I think so. I'm about... 72% uh, sure. Oh, Rebecca. Rebecca. What's wrong? She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Now get in here. How do you know it's your kid? Huh? You don't have proof. You don't have a DNA test. Alvin? Oh! Alvin! He passed out hours ago. He can't hear nothing. No point in making a racket. Let him go. Please. Why would I do that? I wouldn't be so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. You're an asshole. Now. What? Poor Alvin. You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are. And you won't end up over in that chair. Well, you know what? I'm gonna lie to you. You might not believe this after what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. No, you didn't. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let depression sink in during times like this. Why'd you call him But that? he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. 
That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will and weak of character. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. You're a murderer. Hey, you're a murderer. You can try and call it something else. But I know what it is. What it really is. Listen, Asshole. Clementine. It ain't murder. Yes, it is. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. Do you mean the royal you understand? Or do you well, mean I wish it was us? different, I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd nope. the flock, to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, I'm not, like you. not to lead. I'm not like you. I know it when I see it. And we're more alike than you think. -uh. In fact, I think you realize it, but you're not comfortable with it yet. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared, but you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. Yeah. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, the next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way. The way my child will be raised. Not it ain't even this your herd kid? that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. Tell it's not knowing me. if I got anyone to hand all this off to. But I ain't worried about that anymore. It's not your baby. It's Alvin's. Ha! Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. You're an asshole. All right, now. Bill, you there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Troy really knocked the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Yeah. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. I hate him. I hate him so much. The Gmail unlocked. One long day. It has been a long day. It's been a really long day. Dealing with Carver's ass and... Ugh. Where's Ken? Because we all know what happened this morning. Oh, there I don't know what that son of a bitch is gonna do next. So you want to ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Because this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just got to figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying, but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous. Hey! Maybe Luke could help us. He's outside. He wants a radio to help keep an eye on the guards. Thank you. That's the plan I vote for. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If mm -hmm. Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? Jenny. There was a girl back at Crawford that used church bells to send walkers all over the city. We just need something really loud. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. There's some speakers outside the building, pointed toward the parking lot. Mm. I saw them when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. I saw the controls. They're in Carver's office. She's right. Yep. It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just gotta get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. Rebecca, You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Penny. No, that's all right. You ain't exactly a peach we either. Both. Luke's in no shape to help us. You want to put our fate in that guy's hands, it's not happening. Why can't we do both? Even if we bring the herd to us, it's probably good for Luke to be able to tell us where they're coming from. You know what? Fine. I can get behind that. Yeah. 
Okay, oh, so reason. we get that turd radio and hey. keeps us posted on the herd's movement. That's not nice. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually. Actually, I do it all the time. <laughs> I just had a freaking... First words I ever hear you say, and it's just some crazy, stupid shit. Hush. We talked at what the same time. What exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. It's true. Now I don't know who's crazier. No, it's true. Trust me. I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. You seem to know what you're talking about. Lee figured that out. What? Yeah. It's how we got out of the marsh house. Lee covered me and we walked right through. Really? Yep. Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. Aww. All right. What are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that, too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Of course, everyone needs my help. Where the hell did she come from? Ah, uh, good question. We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't fall to your death. Great. Okay, that thing breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Come on, up and at him. Don't push her, Kenny. Uh, She's our best bet. Now or never. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, I guess. That's my girl. Aww. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost her up? Come Please. on, kid. Thank you. Don't let go. <laughs> I got you. Ba -ba! Pull it. There we go. There you go, Clem. Huh. Thank you very much. And up we go. Pretty convenient how that was placed there. Right. I don't think they're the again. sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. Yeah. They see you not in your bunk. We're all done. Shit, he's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something. Yes, okay. Huh. Ouch. It's okay, Clem. You're okay. Oh, the herd. We're in trouble. Yeah, we are. Oh, gosh. Walk, walk, walk. Okay. No, don't look at me. That's, You're not gonna believe what I'm looking at. Uh, There's no, gotta be go. two or three Greenhouse. thousand of them out there. There's gotta be two thousand. In the parking lot? In the parking lot. No, not in the parking lot. I can't see oh, them all, but locked. I see the dust they're kicking up. Okay. Uh, so you're not sure? Let's look. What about how many there are? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Too close. Too close. How can I be? Freaking hell! They passed by us. God, yeah. Looking at blueprints. You think we're ready this time? I don't know. Blueprints don't for. We are. Of course he does, but he thought the same thing last time. Let's use that. Last time. No, this, this is enough though. This is gonna be locked too. We'll find out if they turn. Yeah, I way. knew it. Yeah. I know where we gotta yeah. go. Oh, please don't look at me. Please don't look at me. We gotta go over here. Wait. I'll show you guys. We gotta go right over here. Essentially, yeah, we gotta go through one of the skylights. Go, go, Clem. Go, go. Waddle, waddle like your life depends on it, which it does. Oh, gosh. There we go. Oh, careful. Oh, ever so quietly, jeez. Uh huh. Careful. Oh, walkie talkies. We need one of those. 
crazy about Reggie, huh? Yeah. You think Bill... Go on. Killed him? I was just... I was wondering if you thought Bill maybe... Spit it out, Hank. I don't think Bill's gonna let him back in. No. You don't? No. Do you? I don't know. Not. So really, no bullshit. You think we're ready? I think so. The homestead, at least. I'm not sure about the expansion. They're out there just moaning. Yeah. That's what they do. It's driving me crazy. It's really unnerving. I know uh. what you mean. You figure we'd be used to it by now. I wouldn't figure that. <gasps> I never got used to a light buzzing or anything. A little different when it's dead human beings walking around. I'll give you that one. How'd she not so see us? Bill wants me to start getting this bay door fixed. Is that why you're down there? Yep. What happened to it again? Troy backed into it when we brought the prisoners, the, the new people in. See, it's yeah. not to call them prisoners. Anyway, I'm looking at it now. I don't think we have what we need. Jesus, <laughs> really? We repurposed a lot of shit to get this place built. I can't say for sure if we even had there the materials know, before you. we started expanding. No one those walkie talkies be connected to all the other ones. You would think it would be. Huh. What is she doing? Oh gosh. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Woohoo! Good job, Clem! Excellent performance. Good job. There we go. Now we're going back down. You get him? Okay, jump down. I got you. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. I trust you. Oh, thank you. You're we so nice. Death. Troy will be back any minute. Yeah. Well? Got him. Cute little devil. Ha 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 ha. Damn straight. Badass Clem. Hi, Sarah. Everybody stay where you are. No need to draw on suspicion. That was so cool. Thank you, Thank Sarah. Thank you, Clem. I told you you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. Thanks. <laughs> uh, it was nothing. It was nothing. Sure it was. Sure it was. Anyway, get some rest. I should have said thanks. I feel kind of rude now. Aww. I thought about Duck today. About his... Dumb little face. Aww. First things that come to mind are always the dumb things he was doing. Yeah. Kid was always running in circles. Every damn place he went, he'd just run. He couldn't stop him. And he hugged the swing. Makes it harder to remember he was a good boy. And he tried to be a detective. Well, long day tomorrow. One long day. Oh, I miss Duck. Oh, Duck was so sweet. Honestly, I love Duck. Achievement unlocked. Always the quiet ones. All right, we're all here. Yep. Someone's got to get the radio out to Luke. What's the problem? We should probably figure out who's doing what before we. Oh. Mm. Time to get up. Daylight's burning. They let you sleep in, all things considered. Where's my dad? We didn't sleep. He's where the rest of you are going. To work. There's Rebecca, I mean. Nick, Sarah, Jane. If you gotta take a piss, do it now. The next break won't be for a while. Troy will be coming up for the rest of you. Why just them? Like I said, Troy's coming for the rest of you. Uh-huh. Meanie jerk pants. Not nice person. Oh, Kenny. Yeah, all right, I look, bet. If we're gonna do something, we have to do it now. And if Luke's all we got, and we pair up with him, I can do it. Where's the meeting? Mike. Yeah? Clementine should do it. Are you fucking of kidding? Of course. <laughs> no offense, but come on. That's crazy. She's a kid. Why would. There's a million reasons. She Everyone knows Luke. Sense. She can hide. She got the damn radio for us in the first place. Who cares? And I'm sorry, Mike, but I don't know you from fucking Adam, all right? And if I'm trusting someone to do something this important, 
I'm trusting her. I'll you don't trust it. me to get a radio to someone? Kenny's right. I should do it. Don't do something stupid just to get some respect. She doesn't need your respect. Give me the radio. All right, little chickens. Let's get to pecking. All right. I'll do it. I don't think today's gonna be like yesterday. No way. No shenanigans. This rooster's gonna be surveilling your ass every second of the day, you hear? Uh-huh. Got that? I'm afraid I need an answer, girl. Yes, sir. Yes, Come sir. on. Oh, you have your pockets all out. Okay, you didn't have to draw attention. Gonna get your tags all snagged on something. <laughs> Just shrug. Let's go. Okay. Just like, meh. I don't know what that was about. I don't know. Don't ask us. Mm -hmm. Hey, she's with me. Oh, shit. I almost forgot. Huh. Yeah. Hi, Bonnie. Well, take her then. I don't Ow! care. Ow! Wait, wait. What's going on? Never mind. Just chores of a different sort. Come on, city mouse. City mouse. Well, I think I should end this episode here because I'm offended. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, do what you want, and stay tuned for the next episode of The Walking Dead Season 2. Bye!